Over to Melbourne had a crowd of more than 25,000 gathered at the cricket ground to see the Flying Dutch Woman, sometimes called the Flying Housewife because she's the mother of two children. Fanny Blankus can't perform miracles at the Olympic Games. She's the world's greatest woman athlete. And there she is, tall, easygoing. Fanny is trained and managed by her husband, Ken Blankus. The girls warm up for the various events. Australian stars Joyce King and Shirley Strickland are competitors. The Dutch woman, too, is loosening up. They're on their marks for the 100 yards invitation race. Lancus Cohen is third from right in white jumper. She hangs on the blocks a little and gets a bad start. At 35 yards, June Ramsey is a yard ahead of Fanny with Shirley McConaughey, Joyce King and Joan Young inches away. Going like a flying machine, Blankus Cohen turns on the heat and flings herself over the line to win by half a yard from Shirley McConaughey. Time 11.4 is no record, but an amazing run for a woman who has done no competitive racing for months. She's certain to improve these figures. Mrs. Blankus Cohen contested three events in the afternoon, including the high jump. She has a fine style and soars over the bar with apparently effortless ease. Whoops, took off too early. Well, even a champ can make a mistake, but is Fanny's face red? There's going to be no mistake this time. She flies the bar at 4 feet 11 inches. Again, no record, but she needed to go no higher to beat the local asses. Six face the starter for the 80 meters hurdle. Fanny's away like a flash this time, and although she bowls over the first hurdle, it doesn't slow the hot party set. She's only inches in front of Shirley Strickland, but she seems to have the race well in hand. Fanny goes on to win easily. Shirley Strickland dead heats for second with Wilma Collins. Plenty of judges. Let's analyze a great race in slow motion, especially the classic style of Blankus Cohen, which Australian athletes would do well to study. Her remarkable yet relaxed leg muscular development is obvious as she flies over the obstacle. Her speed between jumps is remarkable. In the run to the tape, the camera emphasizes the amazingly powerful leg drive which has carried her to victory so frequently. To the applause of the multitude, Fanny Blankus Cohen, world champion, received the trophies which are the amateur's reward. It's been a field day for Holland and her flying daughter.